Minister for Roads and Highways, Kusia Mwakwata, says government has directed the release of money to settle debt owed contractors. A greater portion of an estimated $1 billion is earmarked for outstanding payments. Prince Apia was at a stakeholders meeting where he made the statement and reports. Government indebtedness to contractors is a major challenge for players in the industry, as some of whom have threatened to demonstrate. There has even been suggestion for government to legislate on the matter as part of measures to regulate management of such debts. Sector Minister, Mr. Mwakwate's deputy, Kwabna Owusu-Ediomi, says the situation amounts to cost to government due to implication to project execution. The delay in paying for work done by the contractors, as the chairman rightly so indicated, is also affecting us. The Ministry of Roads and Highways and the government of Ghana is paying huge interest on delay payment. About 80% of the IPCs that have had the privilege to go through prior to the Honorable Minister's endorsement are claims on interest on delay payment. This is very worrying. Whilst we are here, we need to strategize and see what we can do. Huge amounts are being paid in projects as price fluctuations because projects travel beyond their initial contractual completion period. The communities also do not receive the early benefits that these ongoing projects were to give them. The minister then gave assurance funds are available for payment to begin soon. He spoke at the strategic meeting in Kumase for stakeholders in the road sector. And I want to assure all contractors in this country that the president and for that matter, the government is applied to this responsibility. And I am happy to announce that His Excellency the President has directed the Minister for Finance to give one billion United States dollars to my sector, greater part of which is to go into the direct payment of all outstanding and delayed road payments. Mr. Mwakwata hints contractors on Cocoa Roads previously under the Agric Ministry will be paid first beginning next week. That all contractors working on Cocoa Roads will be receiving letters from the various agencies starting from next week. Where we have selected the, the critical ones and they may be asked to go back to work. I want I therefore want to appeal to them that they should continue to work closely with government. Meanwhile, the ministry wants its directors and engineers to always ensure they operate within budget. Prince Apia reporting. You're watching News Desk with me, Bernice Abubedo Lanza. Still to come in this bulletin, we've got tech news from around the world, including how Instagram is hoping to block hashtags spreading fake news about vaccines. We'll be back shortly with details.